Chama tawala cha UDA sasa kinamtaka kinara wa Zimio Raila Odinga atiwe nguvuni na kufunguliwa mashtaka ya ugaidi kufuatia aliyojiri katika maandamano ya jana. It is therefore clear that Azimio leaders behind the wanton destruction of property and acts of lawlessness and loss of life are guilty of terrorism and must be held to account. Viongozi wa UDA wameitaka serikali mkabili Odinga vilivyo ili kuzuia maandamano katika siku za usoni. Na tumeweka mikakati ya kutosha kuhakikisha jambo kama hilo ambalo lilifanyika jana halitafanyika tena. You must be dealt with decisively. And that is why we have called on our government to deal with Mr. Odinga, his sponsor and all the other economic saboteurs with the full force of the law and nobody should be spared. Country must stop treating Mr. Odinga his sponsors and the perpetrators of the attack with kin's gloves and instead let him bear the full consequences of his murderous act wakati huo huo mkuu wa mawaziri musalem udava de mekashifu vikali maandamano ya azimio akidai kuwa odinga natafuta serikali ya nusu mkate hii ni mbinu ambayo imetumika hapo awali kwamba baada ya uchaguzi watu wanaleta mambo ya fujo ili wakatiwe nusu mkate kwa serikali. Mudavadi vile vile ameibua madai kuwa maandamano yanafadhiliwa na rasmi mali za serikali za kaunti huku akipuuza shughuli ya kusanyaji saini inayokusudiwa kumuondoa mamlaka ni Rais Ruto. Tumefika kiwango kwamba hiyo habit lazima ikomeshwe. Kama serikali sisi tunasema hatutaki mambo ya kufikiri kwamba we shall be intimidated into submission are we creating political vampires joel chacharuninga ya k24 nairobi